My neighbor keeps threatening to shoot my dog if he barks, if he barks or gets loose again. Wow. He is not a violent dog, but he is a Rottweiler, so he looks intimidating. Sure. I have a fence yard, but sometimes he will dig out and run out the front door when I open it. They used to happen to our <laughs> German Shepherd all the time. Happens to our dogs all the time. Yeah. My question is, is he legally allowed to shoot my dog just because he gets loose? No. No, but that doesn't matter because this guy will do it anyway. Yeah, it, but yeah, he still can and will, right? If he's threatening that. Okay, if he's even threatening that, he's probably got a few screws loose because that's not, I mean, that's not a neighborly thing to do. You can be upset about someone's dog barking. I get it. You can be ex- upset about somebody's dog running up and, you know, running up to your house or whatever it is when he gets, people are scared of dogs. So a big dog, like a Rottweiler running up to them could be scary, but it's no reason to threaten to shoot anybody or the dog. You're not allowed to do that. And I would honestly just stay away from him because he found, sounds like he's got a few Dangerous, screws yeah. Yeah, loose. So Yeah, I would definitely call the police. And maybe like you have to set up some barriers. I remember the last place that we lived at when we had a dog run loose, we had like a little bit of a walkway. So we actually put up a gate through that walkway so that when we opened the front door, if the dogs got loose, there was a gate right there to stop them. And then we could get them back in the house. Yeah. So Maybe on your side, you might have to do a few things to kind of keep your dog in the house. Um, dogs dig out, though. I mean. Yeah, but I'll also say, if you guys remember, earlier this year, my mm. son Jackson was attacked by a neighborhood um, husky. Yeah. This dog grabbed Jackson by the arm. It was 11 puncture wounds in his arm. And this dog drug him through the yard. Yeah. If I would have been outside, yeah. I would have killed this dog. And I told the owner, because this dog has attacked me on my golf cart. It starts biting my golf cart as I'm driving around. Mm -hmm. It attacked John, right? Or tried to bite John. John and another jogger. And another woman who was jogging, it it bit her. So this dog, like, and the dog gets out all the time because Mm -hmm. the kids taking care of it are, they're little kids. Mm -hmm. This is a big ass husky. Yeah. I am telling you right now, if this dog gets out Mm -hmm. and comes after me, I am going to kill it. Yeah. I promise you. But because it, it is a violent, dangerous dog. Yes, it has a should record. not be around people. But he said that his dog is not violent, so I'm guessing his dog hasn't bitten somebody before. So if this is the case, so you're asking, is it legal? No, it's not legal for him to do it, but it doesn't mean it matter. It doesn't mean that he won't. You can, if your neighbor verbally threatens again, you can make a police report just so that it's on file. You can have it if on If the file. police are willing to even come out and do a if, report. If they're willing. Okay. Because somebody threatened to murder me and my family and the police wouldn't even, Hillsborough County Sheriff's Department yeah. wouldn't even come and fill out a police report of it because they were yeah. too damn lazy. Yeah. So, I mean, but you can try so that you have something on paper. I mean, that's probably what I would do just so yeah. that you had something on paper. But my advice to you would be to figure out how you can keep your dog inside, figure out, I am Listen, in my garage, I still have, because we were going to put a fence up and we never did, but I still have, there's no dig uh, fence, like ground posts that you can get from Home Depot. They're kind of expensive, but you smash them into the ground by your fence. And then even if your dog digs, it's like another like this far of like steel where they can't get through. So maybe that's an option, Um, you know, best of luck to you, but yeah, sucks.